Welcome to the Daily App Show. Today we're going to take a look at ProCell for the iPad. ProCell is an application for those of you who are sales reps for uh, distribution type companies and this is the demo that you're able to download and do some testing. ProCell is a tool that is customized for your business, so this demo, of course, has a lot of features to give you an idea of how the app is to function. However, you work with ProCell and the company behind ProCell to customize it for your sales experience. So we're looking at the home screen right here. When you launch the app for the first time you will enter in your contact information and that will gain you access to the features I'm about to show you and then you're able to take a look at the application uh, and see how it may uh, work to benefit your company. What this is supposed to do is prevent you from having to carry around large binders and books full of product information uh, that's hard to sort and get through uh, to show your customers. So we're on the home screen right here if we tap on customers, we can see a list of our customers. Right now you can see uh, that we have one selected down here. And if we scroll through the information down below, we can see kind of a preview of their information. For example, their sales, their AR detail, uh, their pricing information. Let's tap on Tavern at the Oaks. We can see here that they've got a little bit more information. Uh, we have their last sales date. We've got uh, their last payment amount. And if I tap on the arrow next to their name, I can get a full detail of all of their information. Uh, some of that could be scrolled through here. We've got basic customer information, full AR information, uh, lots of different fields of information right here uh, that is valuable for us to know when our customers are asking questions. Um, so rather than having to go to a book or some information or key it in on your BlackBerry or open up your laptop and enter in and figure out all that information it's all available to you right here as well as customer notes contact details so if we wanted to place a new order or view previous orders taken we can create a new blank order we can create a new order from history or we could view our orders taken let's create a new order from history so what we're looking at now is a complete list of items that this specific restaurant has ordered from us before. So what's nice here is that we can get access to the previously ordered items. We can also ask our customer how they're doing on certain items uh, because we have lots of information here about their previous order. So I could simply tap on an item and it's going to go ahead and increase that number. If I tap and hold, I can type in any number that I would like. So as you can see here, I just typed in number two. Notice when I tap on an item, an image shows up, a description shows up. We have sales history, pricing information, what we have in stock, and then we have also additional information fields um, like nutrition and marketing that can be customized uh, based on the type of information that you would like to have available um, with each item. We can also select our view options and go to image view and view by image. So say we need some avocados, we can tap here. Notice we're now in full view for a individual product and we could see full description, sales history, pricing info. We could change price, change quantity, remove it from order. So we'll just go ahead and add uh, one of these and hit done. And then if I go back and you'll notice that our order total is always updating right up here at the top so that we could see the total price for the order, how many cases, how many each items, and we can continue to move on. Viewing options here, notice we can sort by item number, item name, and any additional fields that we've had customized into the app. Also basic detail, image, and order header as well. Let's go back to detailed list. Notice here that we've got updates with all of our information. If I need to change anything, all I have to do is tap and hold and I can do that. So when I'm ready to close my order, of course, I just tap close order and I could do that. If I need to find more items, I can do a search. For example, if I type in grape, see that everything is updating on the fly. I have grapefruit, which of course the root word of grape there at the beginning that shows up and then grapes themselves these are also from two different companies and so I can view items uh, just by searching and it automatically uh, sorts that information for me and then I also have my viewing options as well and I can view those items any way that I would like and then of course add to my order 
and then my order updates just like that. Let's tap close order. If this ready's or order is ready to send, I can hit yes, no, or close without saving. So we'll go ahead and tap on yes, and that order has been submitted, and we're back at our customer page. Now, what's nice is we can also go into item browse, and we can browse our entire catalog of, of images. Um, or, of course, we can go back to a detailed list and get our detailed list um, of our entire catalog, and we can search through that. So even if a customer hasn't ordered anything from that area before, we can go and view our entire item list right here. You could also go and view our order log, which shows any previous orders that we've made. Being that I'm in demo mode right now, anything that I create is, of course, not going to save. Um, what we want to do here is contact AI2 uh, to find out a little bit more information about uh, every feature that's available. Also in more, we have a help section that you could tap on and it goes into a tutorial that you can view. And then we have the ProSync button there that allows us to sync up the app. So essentially the way that this works is you partner with them to send all of your information so that they can get it entered into uh, this system. You probably already have a system in place, so they try to work with the system that you already have to implement this information into the app so that you can have it readily available in an iPad. How much nicer would it be for your sales reps to carry around an iPad with all customer and product information readily available instead of stacks of binders or laptops and many other things that are required to pull this off? So if you're interested in ProCell, of course you see the information uh, ticker down below and you can contact them directly. Uh, of course that information is also available right here on the order log page. So uh, give them a call and they will put together a uh, customized detailed quote for you based on your needs. And keep in mind that the features that you have seen in here can be customized for your needs. So check out ProCell. It's a free demo download for you to try on your iPad and uh, you can see how it would benefit your company and your sales reps. Check it out in the App Store.